So it is October 13th and uh, I finally just got home from work. I'm actually taking a look at our Onyx maps to try to devise a game plan for the evening sit. Um, according to this it looks like we have the wind coming out of the west and it's currently 68 degrees. It's far less than ideal for an October archery hunt but nonetheless we're going to go. Um, Cliff's got a busy couple weeks at work, so you all will be stuck with me and just me. <laughs> um, so I think I know where I'm going to sit tonight. I think we're going to go sit on the crick and um, see what we see. But I will not shoot a doe tonight just because, like I said, Cliff's pretty busy with work this week and next. So I'd kind of be at it by myself, and I don't really feel like tracking a doe and gutting the doe and taking care of a doe by myself so I will only be launching an arrow if it is a buck or a bear which would be great um, we've had some bear activity down by this stand where I'm gonna go sit tonight um, so maybe we'll see a bear maybe we'll see nothing at all I don't really know it's still pretty warm out so um, we haven't seen too many deer up on their feet at this point in time but like I said I'm home from work early so I'm gonna go sit in the tree stand and I will take you along. All right, so I just got set up in the tree. <clears throat> and uh, the Onyx app seemed to be spot on. This wind is coming right at my face and blowing my wind back through to over my back there. And I'm actually sitting correctly, so it's actually coming like this. But, man, I felt like I should have been carrying a sign over my head that says I was in here. How loud it is. All these leaves crunching constantly. But got on as quiet as I could. I don't know how quiet that really was, but we'll sit here. We have, it's almost five o'clock now, so we have a couple hours still um, before dark. These birds in here are having a heyday, though. They must be loving this warm weather. <clears throat> so we'll sit here and hopefully something comes out. At pretty much anything that walks in front of me here is within 35 yards, so if a big buck or a bear did come, it'd be a very close shot, which is a good thing, <laughs> but it's also a bad thing because they're right on top of me, but uh, it's a nice night either way. Mosquitoes aren't killing me like they have been the past couple of weeks, which I figured they would be right off this creek, but that's a good thing, I guess. I did bring the thermosel though, just in case. So. Hopefully we see something, and whatever I see, you will see. Well, I made it back to the house and unfortunately got a big old goose egg today. I saw absolutely no deer. Not a sight of one, not a sound of one, nothing. So uh, we'll give it another go tomorrow as long as everything goes as planned. Um, I should be able to hunt after work tomorrow. So we'll hope for better luck tomorrow. Um, yeah, that's all I got. <laughs> Pretty uneventful evening, but that's how it goes sometimes, especially in this early earlier season when it's still pretty warm out. Um, all we can do is cross our fingers for a good cold front that will get these deer up on their feet. So until tomorrow, take care. <laughs>